Hey, fabulous family. It's your girl, BJ. We are back. We are rolling in this kitchen. And I want to thank you for joining me tonight. It is dinner time and a sister is hungry. So we're going to do a quickie. We are going to do some yellow rice over, sh well, shrimp, garlic shrimp over yellow rice. First, I'm going to do the yellow rice. Okay, and then we're going to get on to those shrimp. But first things first. Okay, I'm going to share the ingredients really quick. We got about a third of a yellow bell pepper. We got a third, about a one third of a white onion. Four fresh garlic cloves. We're going to mince those. And we have one tablespoon of garlic powder and one tablespoon of onion powder in here. And then we have one fourth teaspoon of turmeric. And then we have two cups of long grain Mahatma rice. I washed it like four or five times because the, the more you get the starch off, the fluffier your rice will be, okay? So that's what we got right here. I washed it and it's just sitting drying out, ready to go in that pot. Okay, and we're gonna use about two tablespoons of chicken bouillon later down the road. Okay, and two cups of water. So we're gonna get started with chopping up these vegetables. Now I'm not gonna sit here and chop up vegetables on the camera. I'm just showing you you know how I'm dicing mine you don't want them real big that's why I cut like a, a little piece off of each one so I could show you you could even make it smaller than that which I'll probably go in and just chop it up a little more and then we're gonna do the same thing with the onion And just chop that up okay now once I get all my veggies chopped up we're gonna go on and put them in the pot we're gonna saute them then we're gonna mince the garlic mix that in there then we're gonna add the seasoning add the rice the water the bouillon and boom we're gonna watch it cook okay so I'll be right back. Let me finish chopping up everything so we can get the next step going. Okay, we got those veggies all chopped up on the chopping board. Now we got this pot on the burner. We're going to just add a little oil. Say about a tablespoon of oil. Once it get hot, we're going to go on and put these veggies in there. Okay, it seems to be pretty hot. So we're gonna go on and put our veggies in there. We're gonna cook our veggies down. Gonna cook them down and then we're gonna add the garlic in here, you guys. Okay, so I'm going to go on and let these cook down, and I'll be back. They're cooking down pretty good, but I'm going to add a little bit of salt just to help them sweat out and cook down. And I'll be back. We're going to mince that garlic next. Okay, I have two in here. We're gonna just go on and mince these. We're gonna 
go on and do the other two. Well, that one's pretty big, so I have to wait. Okay, I gotta constantly stir you guys because I don't want nothing to burn. Get this last garlic off in here. I'm going to stir this. We'll be back to finish the process. I'm going to go on and add a cup of water to it. Now my second cup. give it a stir and we're going to go on and start adding our seasoning in here that's the onion powder and the garlic powder now the turmeric I'm going to let all this blend together okay I'm gonna cut my fire up now I like to give it a taste make sure it's how I want it okay everything seems to be fine so I'm gonna go on and put my rice in here once the fire once I get it up to a uh, get it back hot I just cut the fire up so once it get hot we're gonna go on and put the rice in and then we're gonna put the chicken bouillon in some more water and then we're gonna let it cook. But I'll be back and show you what I do next. Okay, I can see it's starting to boil so we can go on and put our rice in. And we can go ahead put our chicken bouillon in as well now this is where your salt come in at in the chicken bouillon that's why I only put the onion powder and the garlic powder okay that's two tablespoons and we're gonna give it a mix Let all the rice get coated. Okay, I'm gonna let this cook like this for it. A short period of time maybe about eight minutes and then we're gonna go on and add the water and cover it with the lid okay so the water has cooked out of it it's been about maybe seven minutes okay so now all the seasonings have incorporated into the rice so now I'm gonna add about, let's see, about three to four cups of water. And we're gonna put the lid on it and let it boil. Okay. 
Just give it a stir. Now we're gonna cover it up and let it just cook. No more touching it. Ah. I'm gonna leave the lid on, let it cook till about maybe about 10 or 12 minutes. I'll check on it, okay? Okay, you guys, I cut it off. I let the water cook down. I cut it off. Ooh, this pot is hot. Okay, so we're gonna just let it sit. It looks so good, you guys. Okay, so I'm getting ready to do my shrimp. Mmm. Oh my God, it's good. Let me hurry up and do this shrimp, you guys. Look at that. Okay. I'll be back once I make the shrimp and we're gonna taste it all. Yes, we are. Oh my God, this is so good. Mm. Just a little bit on the fork. Woo, woo, woo. All right, I'll be back. Oh my goodness gracious. It's going down. It's going down. I wish you was here with me right now. But since you're not, you're going to go and make yours, and I'm going to go and enjoy this, and I'll see you later.